Clearing nearly 7,000 miles of highway with limited equipment and crews requires a bit of strategy. To ensure efforts are aligned with needs, YDOT follows a snowplow priority plan. The plan sets levels of service based on road type and traffic volume. It's dependent upon what we call ADT, or average daily traffic. So the more people that use the road, the higher that priority that road becomes. Interstates and high volume highways receive 20 or 24 hour service. A majority of state and U.S. highways are plowed and sanded in two eight hour shifts. And low volume roads are provided service as available with local needs considered. Typically they get plowed twice a day, right before the school bus goes out in the morning and right before they go out in the afternoon. The plan helps YDOT provide better service with available resources, which include equipment, materials, and personnel. Right now, our limited resource is snowplow drivers, but we're compensating for that by uh, moving people to the storm. When half the state gets hit, the other half uh, comes down and, or, or across the state and, and helps out. Travelers are urged to plan ahead for winter conditions and be prepared for roads that may be snowy, especially in off hours. There may be a little bit less uh, snow plowing done during the middle of the night, but then uh, there's very few travelers out during that time period. So we schedule our snow plows when the people are out there typically driving. Reminding you to give our plows room to work and always buckle up. This is Doug McGee reporting.